fans are gearing up for a huge game Saturday. Not only is the game a matchup with huge rival Kansas. But ESPN's College Game Day will be in Ames for the game. KCCI's Vanessa Peng live at Hilton Coliseum tonight. We'll look at how fans are getting ready. Stacey, Kevin, fans are already lining up for ESPN's College Game Day. Here you see some tents and some fans, very excited fans, at the front of the line. And on Saturday, ESPN College Game Day will be in Ames for the first time. Some Cyclone fans have waited and waited for this. It's something that we've all watched and been hoping that it'd come here. It's never happened before in Ames, but on Saturday, that's all about the change. ESPN College Game Day will be at Hilton Coliseum for the Cyclones Jayhawks matchup. I was just really surprised that it was here, being it had never been here. Um, but Iowa State, Kansas is a great rivalry. Um, and it's really cool to see that it's a it's big enough to be on game day. The game day bus is already in town. It's making stops all over the area. This is college game day bus, obviously, because it says so. Bobby, the bus driver, is on hand for any questions. Some Gilbert kids are feeling lucky. We've been watching ESPN since we were little, and we just thought it would be a fun experience, and we'd never be able to experience something like this again. In the Somerset neighborhood, even older fans are impressed. Incoming! Whee! The Travelocity Gnome is joining in on the festivities. He's a huge fan of college sports, college basketball in particular. Um, he loves to get to know the local area. So, of course, he went to Hickory Park. Eating barbecue among his new friends he wouldn't have met had it not been for college game day. It's just really cool to um, see a big thing like this in Ames and get attention to the Ames area. We've arrived. We're a national program. Starts Saturday morning at 9, followed by another show at 10, and then at night, an evening show starts at 7. Tip off is at 8. Live in Ames, Vanessa Payne, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.